Does belief in God hinder scientific progress? Are most scientists atheists? We constantly hear these statements in one form or another. Leading atheists say religion goes against the spirit of science. They say, scientists, if you're not an atheist, you're not doing science right. To see if this is true, we will look at some of history's greatest scientists. Werner Heisenberg was a main pioneer of quantum mechanics. He said, the first gulp from the glass of the natural sciences will make you an atheist, but at the bottom of that glass, God is waiting for you. Heisenberg was responsible for some of the most important discoveries in scientific history. He won a Nobel Prize. Was he not doing science right? Then there's Einstein, who said, the more I study science, the more I believe in God. Though he did not believe in a personal God, he made it clear that he was not an atheist. What about Isaac Newton, largely known as the greatest scientist in history? He discovered the mathematical law of gravitation, developed calculus, devised the three laws of motion, advanced modern chemistry, and proposed a new theory of light and color. He was devout in his belief in God. Did his belief in God hinder scientific progress? Then there's Robert Boyle, known for laying the foundations of chemistry as we know it today. Boyle was well known as the founder of modern chemistry. Johannes Kepler developed the three mathematical laws of planetary motion and was the scientist who developed a true celestial physics. He said, those laws are within the grasp of the human mind. God wanted us to recognize them by creating us after his own image so that we could share in his own thoughts. Then we have Louis Pasteur, credited with saving millions of lives through the developments of vaccines. He was known as the father of microbiology. Sir Joseph Thomson helped revolutionize the knowledge of atomic structure by his discovery of the electron. He says, the truth of which is emphasized by every advance in science, that great are the works of the Lord. These scientists were explicit about their faith. They all believed in God. Were they not doing science right? In fact, out of the 52 top scientists of the scientific revolution, which was one of the most important periods in scientific history, 50 of them did not just believe in God, but were devout Christians. Only two were skeptics. These were the rock stars of science, the very people who gave us modern science as it is today. In fact, studies show that out of the 300 outstanding scientists in the world, 242 believe in God. Other studies show that 65% of Nobel Prize winners were Christians. A survey of 3,000 scientists in Europe revealed barely one in four described themselves as an atheist. One in four in the UK and one in five in Germany and France say science and religion contradict one another. So back to the question, does belief in God really hinder scientific progress? Clearly not. Are most scientists atheists? Well, in the words of the famous Neil deGrasse Tyson, this notion that if you're a scientist, you're an atheist, or if you're religious, you're not a scientist, that's just empirically false. 